there's these racing boats here. I don't know if you can see them, but they're pretty cool. It's amazing. They remind me of a jet ski or something. I'll just make a short video about them. I guess they're coming in, but they were out there uh, catching three to six feet of uh, air. There's a couple of them there, so that's pretty cool. They're uh, shutting it down, but yeah, it looked like a ton of fun. A little bit of an unsafe to it as well, but yeah, they were bouncing off the waves and had the front end up four to six feet high. A couple young kids, so that was pretty cool. I was trying to get a shot of them out here. Get back out there, so yeah, I'd like to check that out. I'd love to have one of them, so probably kill myself. I don't know if they're uh, safe. To, uh, I'd like to, you know, be able to cross over the Negro Island, which is over there. You can kind of see the uh, dark spot below the clouds. Uh, so that's the Negro Island on the other side there. So it's another big island We're on the side of here. So you can always see the clouds billowing off up over the mountains there. So anyhow, it was really cool to see that. So here they are again. So. Call them racing boats of some sort. I'm not sure what motor they are, but they're relatively small, and that's the first I've actually seen since I've been here that's uh, run. And uh, yeah, they had it. They were really getting wild on them, so they're very brave or highly skilled or both. So I wish we could have captured uh, more of their ride because they were certainly. Uh, surprised me it remind me of a wave runner jet ski back in america that's the type of uh, air and stunts they were get pulling on them so just quite amazing for such a small boat uh, i was shocked to see them flying through there three to six feet high in spots so yeah quite amazing and then one of them kind of did a quick u-turn or something looked like it was almost ready to sink and then he uh spun it around so quite amazing so but yeah they call them racing boats here for, as far as I know so there's there might this may be one here kind of maybe not it doesn't have the uh has some rigging for some shelters so but there's definitely two out there so maybe he's gonna get back in and do another little show for us but there's a bunch of people here, kids playing basketball and the wrong guy as usual. Basketball is the number one uh, activity in every wrong guy. They got a little volleyball court set up here. I don't know if you can see it there. But I pan back out here. So yeah, they're kind of in and out. So that was pretty cool. So a bunch of guys lined up here laying under the trees watching the uh, activity because they were putting on quite a show so i was impressed which doesn't happen too often so really cool so this is one here in the orange i'll zoom back down on it here the other one may be getting ready to take off if he takes off I'll... looks like he's winding up the coordinator to fire it up so but this is one here. I'll see how tight I can zoom in to, so you can really see it. So yeah, no, uh, nothing sticking up above. Just a couple little pontoon things, uh, kit stabilizers, and uh, yeah, that was that was really cool. I may uh, if I didn't have my phone and had a bat, my dry bag with me because I think I'd definitely be falling in or getting wet. I don't know if take two people but uh, I'm definitely interested in getting one or uh, getting a ride here goes this guy find him again see if he does anything so he's right there so we'll follow him a few minutes see what he ends up doing he may just be going out if he doesn't turn soon we're, I've got you on five times zoom so that's he's Five times closer than he appears. He's probably a quarter kilometer out in the water here, so I don't know if he's going to do anything or not. 
that's quite amazing when he kicks it up and stuff because it looks like he's about ready to sink and he goes flying through the air. So. Take you down here. Hey guys, I like your boat. I like the boat. Yeah, pretty cool. That's that's the racing boat. So yeah, they're getting ready to carry it out. There's the prop and little uh, rudder, so. Uh, they may be gonna lift it up on the stand and work on it. Yeah. Yeah. All right, well, thanks for watching. That's it from Terry's Philippine journey. Pretty exciting. All right, thank you.